excited that I had to come online because, um, like I said, there is nothing, like my title said, there is nothing like your BFF or your best friends forever. Yes, I feel like a 13-year-old calling on my BFF. But tomorrow morning, I am so excited because I am on my way to a girls weekend with my best friends from college. And so, you know, reflecting on everything and thinking about how excited I am and thinking about how stressed I am in life with my kids and my job and my husband and just being a mom and working and all of those other things on top of it. Like, it's a lot of stuff, right? We have a lot going on in our life. And so I am so excited because I am going to see my best friends forever, my college roommates, and we're gonna have the best time this weekend in Philadelphia. And I wanted to, as I'm reflecting, because that's kind of what I do, and for those of you that don't know me and know why I reflect so much, it's probably because I'm a licensed professional counselor, I'm a school counselor, and I'm a mom of two beautiful young girls, and I'm also a beauty builder, building beauty from the inside out. And so I do a lot of reflecting. I guess that's kind of my job, right? As I analyze and I reflect and I do all of these things as a, as a therapist and as a counselor. And so I'm reflecting on, yes, how much I'm gonna miss my kids, but I'm also reflecting on how good this is going to do for my soul and how much fun I'm going to have with my girlfriends and how it's just kind of rejuvenating. We're gonna laugh, we're gonna just hang out. We joke that we like to stare at each other and spend time staring at each other and so that's what we're gonna do this weekend and I'm so excited. And so my message tonight, and it's gonna be really short and sweet because I gotta pack and it's late and my flight leaves in the morning and nope, haven't done a thing of course. It's kind of the way I roll. I'm a spur of the, mo spur of the moment type of person. I'm not a big planner. And so um, basically, my message is take time for yourself. As busy moms, as busy women, it doesn't even need to be moms, we don't take enough personal time. We don't take enough time to ourselves to rejuvenate ourselves and to build each other up and to build ourselves up. And so, you know, for me, there's nothing better than medicine with your best friends. My husband is amazing, I love him, he is one of my best friends, but it's a different friendship than having with my girlfriends. And giggling and laughing and being silly and sharing old memories and it's just so, so therapeutic in itself to have girls weekends. And so I hear so many moms tell me, well I can't leave my kids and I just don't feel comfortable and I've never left them before and I just, I don't know, I don't know if I could do it. And I'm gonna just tell you, do it. It's so, so important. It's important for your husband or your significant other to take the responsibility of your children um, for the weekend or however long it may be. And it's important for you as a busy woman and as a mom to make sure that you are taking your own personal time and kind of re Rebreathing and resurf recentering, sorry, not surfacing, recentering yourself with your girlfriends. And so I am a true believer in the absence makes the heart grow fonder, and your kids will love you. They will appreciate you even more when you get back. And to be completely honest with you, it is really good for them too. It is good for them to see that mom has a life outside of their children, that mom takes personal time for herself, and that mom. Um, can have fun and laugh and be, you know, carefree and not have to worry about anything. I think it's a really important message that we send to our kids on top of what it does for you. And so I really, really urge you to take some personal time with some girlfriends. You know, maybe if you're not one that's ever gone away or left your kids before, take some personal time and <clears throat> go one night and see how that feels and make sure that your husband's got it under control and then go for a little bit longer. And I guarantee at the end of your weekends, whatever it may be, you are going to thank me. You are going to say, Julie, that was the smartest decision I made. I feel so much better mentally. I feel so much more prepared to be a mom in the morning and I feel just rejuvenated. And so I really think that you will thank me and I can't wait to hear where you spend your personal time away from your kids, away from your husband, and hopefully with some of your best friends. So please, 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 I urge all of you moms out there to take some personal time because 
oh, I'm so excited for this weekend and it's gonna be the best time ever. And so, I'm gonna, like I said, I'm gonna make it short and sweet because I got some packing to do and haven't started that. But if you know any moms that are having a hard time, tell them that it's doctor's orders over here, the therapist over here is telling them they need to do it and share this video with them and let them know that they're not alone and that we can um, all, you know, take a little bit of time together or away from our kids and it's going to be the best medicine for us. So please share this video with any moms you know and then in the comment section, I wanna know where you decide to go or where you've gone in the past that have been amazing for a girls weekend. Share it below so that we can all um, get ideas and help each other out. So I hope, hope, hope you guys take this to heart and thank me afterwards and let me know where you go and let me know how it went. All right, everybody have a great time. I'll talk to you later.